Welcome everybody. In today's video, we are going to use the vanishing points to place text on a wall like this. Okay, it's very easy to do. Okay, this text is actually not here, but you're just gonna place it there. Okay, and make it feel as if it's actually there. Okay, first thing you need to do is actually to um, bring in your text and let's just type in word wall me. You can choose any word of your choice. Let's say wall me. Let's go back to the move tool and let's just scale it to the size that we want and click OK. Okay, what you need to do next is to hold down your control key and click on the text here. Okay. The text, not this icon, not the wall, not the text here, but the wall here. I mean the text here. So just click on it and it's going to create a selection on the text. So you hit Ctrl C on your keyboard to copy it. Now you cannot hide this layer. Come here and click a new layer and go to filter and come to vanishing point. And once you're here, all you just need to do is to draw a shape like this that aligns with the wall itself to create that effect. Okay, if it's not aligning the way you want it, just align it and it's going to give you this mesh, okay? Okay, all you need to do now is to hit Ctrl V on your keyboard, which is going to paste the text that you've copied before. And now just drag it into the box and it's just going to give you the magic. Okay, T on your keyboard to actually adjust. Make sure you get handles and just adjust the way you want it. And just keep adjusting. And once you're done like this, just click OK. So now we have our text. Okay, the next thing we need to do is to blend it with the wall. Okay, double click on this gray area here. This is going to bring the blending option and we're going to use the blend if. Okay, since our background is kind of dark and our text is white, so we're going to use the underlying layer to blend it. All you need to do is to come here and hold the Alt key and just drag. This is going to separate these two variables, these two handles. And once they are separated, you can let go of your Alt key and just try to drag until you feel that okay it's good enough and just click ok so that's it that's how you can actually make a text be on a wall so thank you so much for watching if you find this video helpful please hit the like button if this is your first time please hit the subscribe button and today is the day of it to show what i know as a graphic designer thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye